What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Drum Levy here bringing in another Random Topic Tuesdays, a Titanfall gameplay just like last time. Now, I want to give a big shout out to OinkCA for making me that kick-ass intro. I might go mess around with it, add a little bit of my own music here and there, but I'm going to go keep it the way it is right now. Really enjoying it, and also I wanted to show you guys the intro of this campaign mission. Now, ironically, this is the same exact uh, map, and also it's also a flawless just like the same time, except I'm on the opposite side. Last time I was on the um, IMC side, this time I'm on the Militia side, yet I still end the game with 21 kills, zero deaths. I thought that was pretty cool, so I decided to show that to you guys. But anyways, um, the topic of this Random Topic Tuesdays is why I think regeneration, which is basically quote-unquote prestiging in Call of Duty, in Titanfall, and why I think it's absolutely fantastic. Now. The regeneration system works like this, just like in um, Call of Duty, uh, once you get to the max level, in this game it's 50, you can prestige, or recharge in this sense. However, after recharge 2, which is when you become a generation 2 pilot, there are certain challenges that you must uh, complete in order to recharge, and I think that's a brilliant way of make, making sure the player explores very the vast differences in Titanfall for like I just finished my regen ch um, challenges for regen 4 um, and that was to get like tw uh, like 50 no 30 critical hit challenges with the uh, charge rifle um, I had to use the quad rocket and basically it makes you get to the top of the challenges in order to be able to regen to the next regeneration. Now, for mine, I think I had six challenges. The one before that was five. I think the one before that was four. And I think it progresses so on and so forth. Now, also, when you recharge, you get a 0.1% increase with every match. So, when you first start the game, you don't, you're don't. you not a Generation Pilot. You're a Generation 1 Pilot. You have a 1.0% increase of EXP after every match, like normal. However, once you get to Generation 2, you become a 1.1% increase in experience. So, basically, sure, sure, uh, slowly but surely, you basically get to a point where you get more EXP the more you recharge. So... I think in this game, it was brilliant in doing that. It was smart to be able to... And basically, like, I read some articles about why they did, decided to do that. It makes sure you explore what Titanfall has to um, offer. I know for the next one, I think I had to punch or kill pilots um, who were ejecting out of their uh, Titan and kill them while they're in midair. I had to kill five of them in order to be able to regenerate to regeneration six. I'm actually just about to regenerate to regeneration five. I'm actually level 49, so I have about 60,000 EXP to get, um, which would take about six or seven games uh, in order to get, if I can get all my challenges and play my cards correctly, but yeah. Um, this game, I, I, I love it more and more, however, sometimes when you get mixed and you go into a really bad team, and the other team just demolishing you. It really demoralizes you. Um, and also, a lot of people might, uh, might have noticed that I've been playing a lot of campaign missions. And that's basically, it is the quickest and easiest way to regenerate your challenge. To get your re regeneration challenges. Um, because, Titan, like, there's the game, the Last Titan Standing, where it's apparently the easiest way to get Titan kills with a certain weapon. However, I actually find that to be not true whatsoever. I think Titan... Uh, in campaign, 
there are certain missions where there's a NPC Titan, uh, where it's just the game is controlling its own Titan, and it, they're really easy to kill, so it was really easy for me to get the uh, challenge where I had to kill, or, or hit, uh, 30 critical hit challenges with the charge rifle because they basically just stand there and it was much easier so if you guys are actually playing this game and you're looking to recharge it a little bit quicker campaign is the way to go and also it doesn't hurt that most of the time people in there aren't usually the most skilled however if you if I join into a random attrition gameplay there's usually people who are like recharge 8, recharge 9, 6 all that fun and stuff but yeah guys this is basically this game is getting more and more fun. Um, the DLC has been announced. I'm definitely I need to pick up the season pass. I keep on telling myself that. I also need to renew my gold license for Xbox. But yeah, I also got my Titanfall controller. Uh, the next video will actually be of me unboxing it, um, as well as the recharge video when I recharge the Generation Fourth pilot. I'm gonna show you guys what it's like and what it looks like to recharge, or um, quote unquote prestige, as some of you Call of Duty uh, enthusiasts prefer but yeah anyways guys that's it for this video I had to like the last one I had to cut up some pieces that were re relatively boring but at the end I did die however it's during the epilogue like I like the last one it doesn't count so I don't really count those deaths it's really just a hey free X exp everyone just fight to the death um, but yeah anyways guys thanks for watching give me guys um, ideas for what you guys want to see and make sure to leave a like, a favorite, comment, and subscribe if you guys like these kinds of videos. It really means a lot to me, and hopefully I get to see you guys soon. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. This is Rom Liver. Peace. On board the Odyssey to take the ship. Now I'm giving you the same choice. <coughs> Pilot, this is McAllen. <coughs> if you're still on the ground out there, it's been an honor serving with you.